Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. I hope you all are doing well. Let's get started with the video. How bold of you to say that Yan's bonus of 50,000 yuan was a small amount of money before her superior. That explains why you left such an impression on him. What I meant was that the amount of money deposited was less than the amount I used for the counting practicing since we typically practice with a hundred thousand yuan or so. Anyway, you shouldn't have said that since it was quite condescending. Duty noted, ma'am. Did you say anything after that? We were busy at that time, and he's a senior executive, so why would he bother to speak with the likes of us? However, there was a time when he'd often come and wait alongside Jan in the lobby. I even see photos of him from different angles. Do you want to take a look? He's not even a celebrity. With Yan Chu Wang around, no celebrity matters anymore. What are you guys talking about? We were just talking about the time when Yuan was still a teller and Yan was here for business. All oh, right. Luoyan did ask about your whereabouts after you left. Was she the one who asked, or did she ask on someone else's behalf? Who else do you think would ask about you? <laughs> Here, let me try. Aren't you busy, Mr. Zing? Yes, but counting money wouldn't take much time. Oh, many apologies, but this counter is not open to the public. The banknotes no longer seem to be hard to touch as you are slower than before. Why is he here? I've no idea. We bumped into the, each other in the lobby. Maybe he's here to sign up for a credit card and followed me here for a cup of tea? You must be joking. Do you think that a man like Yan Chu Wang would have to sign up for a credit card? We've long given him a black card. Shh, keep it down. This is the only tea I have. Sorry about that, Mr. Yan. Yan Yan, what are you doing? What took you so long? What brings you here today, Mr. Yan? I'm here for personal matters. You should have gone to the VIP along. The lobby is noisy and crowded with people. Yan Yan, why didn't you take Mr. Yan to the VIP along? It's alright. I handled my matters in the lobby a few years ago as well. I'm used to it.
now that you mention it, I remember Yon was still taller at that time. At that time, many of the deposit slip of yarns were handled by me. Uh, I still have matters I need to attend to, so Yon Yon, please keep Mr. Yon entertained. Isn't that what I'm doing now? Goodbye.